All right. Welcome to Doodles. I'm Brendan. I'll be your host. Um, we're going to be drawing, just doing some fun, kind of free drawing um, during this half an hour or so. Um, so if you're watching, feel free to follow along if you have any pen and paper. If not, just come on. We'll, we'll have some fun drawing. All right. What about, what about maybe out a little further? Maybe we got a boat? I guess. Maybe. Big boat. All right. What about what about some animals? What about some cool animals near the ocean? Turtles. Turtles. There you go. Who do turtles hang out with? Anyone? Any idea? Sharks. I don't think so. Just kidding. Seahorse, that's a good one. All right, come up next. This is my favorite animal in the ocean. It's gonna be a big old whale, huh? All right. Whales are huge and they have tiny eyes. What's up How with that? How can such a big animal have such small eyes? It doesn't make any sense. Well, you know, maybe that's why he wears a monocle. That's probably why. <laughs> Glaciers are big things in the north, right? Do you remember the Titanic? Have you heard about that? Yes. Did ice it? Ice glaciers in the Titanic. Right. They crashed into an ice glacier. So, so uh, what do you what do you think happened? Did they just not see it? I think it was just like it was like in the water, mm -hmm. like, and nobody could really see it. Yeah, right. You know, it's that's kind of like this reef here. It's like. Yeah. So, like, the boat would easily crash into it. That's right, that's right. So, if this boat was heading this way, it would. Just... It would. Exactly. Oh, gosh. Like a history class, but through an art class. This is, it's incredible what we're learning. So, Mr. Captain now is in a lot of trouble because he's got a hole in his boat. He's going to have to take it to shore to get it repaired. Well, there's one problem. He's far from shore. Right. Yeah, he's uh, he's now very worried. Okay. <laughs> okay. So they're coming in. Mr. Surfer dude is no longer surfing because it is nighttime. So I got a purple. I haven't used a purple marker yet. So I want to use a purple marker. And what's a cool animal we could draw with a purple marker? Any ideas? Maybe one with maybe one with eight legs. They're not legs. They're... That's right. Awesome. So Mr. Squid is getting the heck out of the way because this boat's right about to shore. All right. So as they're coming in, all right. Psh, let's move. Let's move this boat along here. They're coming in ashore, but Mr. Whale can only take them so long because he's big. He's a big guy. He's not going to be able to get up here. He doesn't have that kind of room. So, Mr. Whale dishes the rope. So, Mr. and Sea Turtle, Mr. Seahorse, they're yelling to the squid, get out of the way, Mr. Squid. What are you doing? There's a boat coming. Um, so, Mr. Squid dashes off, and he's got a little hole he lives in, because that's what squids do. He's still watching the scene, though, because it's, it's terribly exciting at this point. That's purple little eyes poking out. Right? So on come turtle and seahorse all the way up to shore. Looks like they have arrived. Can you believe it? I can't. I didn't know. Yeah, you're telling me. You know? So Mr. Captain, as we can see, is all smiles. Mr. Whale and or Mr. Seahorse and Mr. Sea Turtle. I think it, one of the, I think it's Mrs. Seahorse and Mr. Sea Turtle actually. But what should Mr. Captain do? Do you think, Sydney? He should say thank you to the animals. He should thank the animals, right? So he's just gonna. He's gonna, yeah, he's gonna shout. Thank. 
you. Wow, okay. And so these animals are going to say, what are they going to say? If, you're welcome. They're going to say, you're welcome. So what we've had here is a big, big comic page. It's a big comic page, right? And I hope, I hope you guys follow along, you know? It was the tragedy of the coral reef. Dapper blue, da blue whale is helping out his fellow man, right? And the animals, Mr. Sea Turtle and Mrs. Being Seahorse, nice. they're being very nice, Mr. being very cordial. Just not helpful. Who, Mr. Squid? Well, you know, we can't all be heroes. We can't all be heroes. And he, he, he kind of watched the scene unfold, and maybe, maybe he grew, grew something out of it, you know, just from watching the experience. Um, thanks again, and I'm Brendan signing off, so thank you very much, all right? Take care, kiddos.